Montreal won. They scored a minute and two seconds into the game and went on to win five to nothing. And Thomas Tatar got the goal, and he's on the ice with Phil Deneau and Brendan Gallagher. And in they come with a room to shoot. Gallagher gets one off, and Carter Hart makes his first early save. So shoot the puck early and shoot it often might be a strategy as well. Tried to pass that off to the wing. Now he's got a battle for the puck. Travis Sanheim is back at the blue line. Konechny overskated the puck. And it'll be lugged out to center. Ouellette with the long shoot in. And after the puck, Armina scores! The futility for the Philadelphia power play continues. And Montreal takes the lead. So I think he was thinking, okay, if it's going to be wrapped around, I'll get it. Instead, he should have been up on that to not allow that to come out to the slot. Back to Ivan Provorov. He looks towards the net. The screen is back up. Voracek across to Drew. Farabee working in the slot. One time a score. Jake Voracek from Claude Giroux. A power play goal, and it's tied 1-1. One, one. Every action of Price right off the stick through the lane there, and then the deflection in front. Price is getting his body ready to absorb this. Suzuki against Giroux, and he couldn't do it. It stays in. Farabee with a give-and-go play. Giroux off the boards, fakes a slap shot. Goes across the ice. Voracek changes the angle. Score! Tipped in by Sean Couturier. Set up by Jake Voracek. And the Flyers have the lead 2-1 to one with eight seconds left in the major penalty. Right off Sherrod. Tough place. Watch the feet of Sherrod. He tries to either get a block or get out. Gallagher trying to knock the puck down at the center. Pitlick was awaiting the arrival of the puck. Instead, Thompson brings it in, and his pass is intercepted by Kula. Armia with Druen. And Nick Suzuki scores! Posted in on what looked like would be a harmless shot against Carter Hart. I mentioned earlier you had the goal post that it looked like Hart wasn't even into it. He watched for five minutes. Suzuki. Gallagher. Let the puck get back to Petrie, into Suzuki, drew out of the corner, watched by Matt Niskanen, Suzuki comes in, Gallagher trying to get open in front, he scores! Knocked it out of the air and looks to the heavens in relief, Brendan Gallagher has a power play goal and Montreal is ahead 3-2. to two. It's not where I expected it to be, but he's done this a million times in practice, you do it so many times in games and that's just your in. Lifts the puck out through center, Ben Chirot. Draws it in to Armia. He's checked by Niskanen. That's a defenseman up on the play, and he's got to get back. Here comes Suzuki. Duran goes to the net. There's a shot. He scores. Nick Suzuki right through Hart, and the Canadians have a 4-2 lead. And he's gone. Wow, what a turn of events. No kidding. Yeah, he is clearly offside on that one. And the linesmen here, Shander Alfonso and Greg Dvorsky, are the ones having a look at this play. It's not even close, is it? No. Well, this is going to be an easy call, but what a turn of events and smart play for Vigneault. After reviewing the play, it's determined the play was offside, therefore we have no goal. Please put 529 on the clock. Sherrod trying to get his stick loose, and he couldn't, so Giroux gets the puck. Back to Provorov at the line, watched by Deneau, into Voracek, Farabee in the slot, Couturier down low, Voracek, cross ice, tip score! Joel Farabee in the slot, tipped in that pass from Jake Voracek, and the game is tied 3-3. Seen numerous times to Giroux, this time instead, right in the middle of the three Montreal Canadiens with the stick on the ice. And we start over five on five. Here's Suzuki trying to make something happen. Armia follows him. Nate Thompson is back for the Flyers. Gave the puck away right in front of the net. Suzuki scores. How's that for an answer? Jonathan Drouin with a great play to set up Nick Suzuki. And this one should count. As Suzuki gets in, a no-look pass by Drouin, and Hart's got no chance on that one. He's thinking Duran's going to come out this side. Hey, guess wrong. Battles with Giroux. Made a little pass. Armia against Provorov. Pushed the puck by him. There's an empty net as they get across the blue line. Janot might have a shot at him. Fires a puck. It deflects off Voracek and in. And at center ice, Couturier just knocked Lekkonen down. And look at this. Yeah. Everybody's piling on here. 
18 seconds left. The Canadians get some insurance into the empty net. Went into the empty net. Here's the puck battle. Niskanen can't control it. Lekkanen knocks it down. Voracek frustrated with himself. Let's have a look in the middle. How does this transpire? He's turning and just, yeah, ran, he into just ran into him. Followed by game six. Philadelphia, Montreal. The Canadians are still alive and nobody cares about where the puck is at the end of this game.